to our first look at Survivor Season 29. Season 29? Oh my god, I feel so it. old because I've seen every season except for one. Whoa. This is another blood versus water season. It was so great last time. I'm glad it. they brought this twist back. Loved it. And this time it's all new people. All right, so let's talk let's about the, the couples. Well, wait, where are they? In Nicaragua. All right, now let's talk about the cast. All right, first up, Dale and Kelly Wentworth. They are father-daughter, he's 55, and she's 28. All right, he is a farmer. He's used to hard work, and he hard has, work deserves a seat. Exactly. <laughs> he has seen some S, literally. So he's not ashamed or, uh, you know, standoffish on getting his hands right in there where it's important. Right, so he's used to the hard work, but his social game may be lacking a little bit. Good well, thing he's got his daughter. That's right, because she is the marketing manager. She can read people. Mm -hmm. She's, you know. Yeah, she's but in she there. was also raised on the farm, so she's got a little bit of that going on, too. All right, so they seem pretty good. Yeah. Jeremy and Val Collins, these guys are married. He, They're about the same age 36, 35. He's a little bit older. She's a cop, and mm -hmm. he's a fireman. I would not guess that she's part of Cops R Us. I know, right? <laughs> These guys are freaking hardcore already. He, he started was... shrinking his stomach in prep Ooh. for the show. They're like really serious about it. They they don't look like they are cop and firemen, but they're definitely athletic. Mm -hmm. She's very hyper. She was doing those push-ups yeah. in the video. Woo! She's laid, uh, he's laid back. They would vote each other off. You gotta have that separation of church and state there. You gotta say, look, I might have to cut my loved one loose if yeah, I need to. But not only that, uh, Jeremy was saying that if his wife wins, it's like a fail for him. Yeah. He wants to win. These guys are determined. All right. These are my favorite couple up next, Josh Canfield and Reed Kelly. They are Christian boyfriends. That's an interesting combination there. Right, 32 and 31. Uh, They're both singer, actor, dancers. All right, Josh is a writer, and Reed is a model, and he's An aerialist. Awesome. Yeah, I wonder if he's <laughs> in the crazy. silks or what. I don't know. So... They're my favorite. I don't know how far they're going to go. I hope really far because I really they're, like them. they're I think, really fun. You know, dancers have an advantage somewhat because you got the whole balance thing. Right. A lot of times you have endurance. So I think they could do really well in some of the physical competitions. Well, Josh is at a little disadvantage. He wears his heart on his sleeve. He's got no poker face. Oh. The key to success, though, is to lay low. But Reed also he's has gonna a little... He's going to be hungry. He's going to be hungry a lot. He hasn't he been shrinking his stomach in no. preparation. But I hope these guys go far, because I really like them. All right, next up, Keith and Wes Nail. All right, father-son. They're both firemen. Mm -hmm. The dad's a fire captain. He's 53. The son's 23. Um, They're they, ready to cut each other's throats. They're, yeah. They seem very competitive with each other. They're they like, you shoot 10 squirrels, I shoot 11 <laughs> squirrels. Why yeah. are you killing all those squirrels? Leave them alone. They're outdoorsmen. But he still lives at home. Yeah, so we were a little, a little confused failure to launch. <laughs> when the son was like, yeah, uh, I found out that it was blood versus water, so I called up my dad and was like, you going to go on the show with me? Would you call him up from the basement? Dad! Dad! dad <laughs> we want the meatloaf! You want to go on Survivor? The meatloaf! Ev! <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. They're a couple of knuckleheads. All right, another couple of knuckleheads. Oh, boy, you should recognize these guys if you watch CBS a lot. <sighs> the Amazing Race. They're twinnies! It's Natalie and Nadia Anderson. They're both 28. Because they're twinnies! Yes. They're both CrossFit coaches, too. Which I didn't I, know that. I'm a little surprised at, because I wouldn't expect that they would... I thought they would be... Not that. <laughs> Alright, well, they've been on The Amazing Race twice, but they were eliminated first on All Stars. Well, let's hope they can keep the annoying factor down to a minimum. Maybe it'll be better if they start on separate tribes. Yeah. And they're away that's from what each I, I'm other? Thinking that I'm hoping too. for that. I'm think, but if they let the diva come out... Do you think they're going to be recognized by their tribe yes, mates? Yes, absolutely. I think there's a good chance. All right, Drew and Alec Christie. These guys are brothers. Oh, boy. 25 and 22. <laughs> These two are ridiculous. They are SoCal's at heart. They're from Florida, but they're totally SoCal. So they're SoFlo's. Mm -hmm. uh, Drew is a sales rep He's in the, family, for the biz. family biz. That means 
He couldn't get a job outside the family biz. All right, well, he, he didn't like, finish college. No, because he was there on a scholarship and like he was there for the experience. I quit my scholarship, whatever that means. Uh, I you wanted probably the full got experience. Kicked off the scholarship because you couldn't make grade. Yeah. Well, then he traveled the world as a model. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, <laughs> his brother is a student. I think it was at, like, Florida Gulf Coast, right? Yeah, something like that. And, uh... He's a lax player. You know, he's Need about to I wrap that up, more? though. Yeah. He's about to wrap he's that up. He's holding that over his brother's head that, uh, he's, he's finishing college. Mm -hmm. He said it was really hard, though, so I'd love to see that GPA. <laughs> All, right, All right, well... I'm amazed these two can put together a sentence. Like we said, they seem like a couple of meatheads. We'll see how they do. All right. Up next, uh, another meathead. John Rocker. And his girlfriend, Julie McGee. All right. They are boyfriend. Yeah, you just said that. They're boyfriend right. and girlfriend. They've been together for three years, and they live together. Right. So he's so, 39. Here's, she's 34. Here's another person that people may recognize. John Rocker was a very vocal he's a <laughs> major league pitcher. He's a former b-ball a-hole. Remember all those rude comments that he made about New York City? Get out of here. <laughs> all right. It's funny that he listed in his pet peeves rude people. <sighs> Really? All right. The three things that he wants to bring to the island is some vodka, a razor, and a toothbrush. Well, Julie wants to bring sunblock, toothbrush, and a radio. So Wait. I'm going to assume that these two have some very nice teeth. Okay. And she also owns her own spray tanning business. Typical. Not going to say anything about that, but... Well, I'm intrigued shocker. to see what this guy is like outside of baseball and the media. You know what I mean? Yeah. It should be interesting. I'm expecting more of the same. All right, so up next, John Mish and Jacqueline Schultz. Another These, boyfriend and girlfriend. For three years. What a uh, coinkening. He's 26, she's 25. He is a financial assistant, mm -hmm. and she's a media buyer. And pretty, they're... Pretty white bread. They're kind of like an all-American couple, I would say. Like, he was the football player, she was Miss... She's a pageant girl, Michigan. Yeah. And... She has a weird condition that's actually not really that weird. It's 1 in 4,500 people are born without a uterus, or 1 in 4,500 women are born without a Did uterus. Did not know that. So they really want to win the show because they want to either adopt or have a surrogate mm -hmm. or eventually get married and have kids. Yeah. We need I, a lot of money for that. They, they're likable, but I think they're unfortunately a little naive for the show. Yeah, they're like, wouldn't it be great if we got like a couples alliance together after the merge? That's never going to happen. Good luck, happen. guys. <laughs> All right, last couple is Missy Payne and her daughter, Baylor Wilson, their mother-daughter. Right. The mom is 47, and the daughter is only 20. All right, seems like <sighs> these two should be interesting as well. Okay. Because the daughter was like, yeah, I'm only 20, but I feel like I'm, like, 30 because of all my life experience. Meaning, mom was married and divorced three times. Whoa. Yes. She seems like a very strong woman, though. Like, she owns her own cheer gym. Even though she's never been a cheerleader. That's crazy. And her daughter is a competitive cheerleader, and um, she's very athletic. She's a student. I'm thinking the daughter will probably go pretty far, but I think the mom, when I, when I see married and divorced three times, I think... She's got some emotional issues going I don't on know. there. And I think she's probably going to break down without the daughter there. We'll see. <laughs> so, yeah. We'll see. All right. So this show starts Wednesday, September 24th, right before the Big Brother finale. Ooh. And who do you like? I really like uh, the boyfriends, Josh and Reed. Love them. I don't just like them. I love them. Yeah. And I like the father-daughter. I, I really agree, like yeah. them, too. They, they have a good relation. Mm-hmm. Uh, to win, who would be your pick? I don't know. I'm really, I, I'm having a tough time picking out people who will actually be, I don't know. I'm thinking the, uh, fireman cop. Okay. I, I can see that. I think at least they'll go pretty far. All right. Because I'm think they're going to keep it under wraps. All right, guys, let us know what you think in the comments. What do you think of this group? They're a good group. Jeff Probst seems to be pretty excited about it. And Jeff Probst, keep doing what you're doing, boy. You're looking good. <laughs> All right. Till the 24th. Much, Much love. love. Edit. 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 Edit.